Hello everyone, this is Victory. I am in the workshop. We have different types of the water spout, or we call it like a downpipe machine in the workshop. And uh, this kind of machine was built up with different function. Firstly, in front of me, there is one rectangular pipe. The size is about uh, 110 in width and the 75 in height. The thickness, uh, the input, the feeding strips is 355. This machine is under fabrication in the workshop. And this machine, the cutting method is saw cutting by cutting saw. And we have applied the double chain for transmission. Wall panel is all regular. Uh, it's very regular and the normal transmission. And the body structure is h beam. Somehow this unit of the machine is economic solution. It's, as you know, we have also the three-in-one machine. So this sort of the machine is economic solution. From here will be the input table. One side we have the chain transmission, but for the big roller, for the big forming roller, we add this kind of the gear which connected with up layer and the down layer roller to increase the power as well as the running accuracy. So let's check one step by one step what we do by assemble the roller. We have the, as we know, we have the forming roller and also we have some assistant roller. Here is in the middle of the forming steps. And from this station, we add a lot of assistant roller, like a vertical roller, to regular the inner pipe during the forming. This unit of the roller will help to form the shape. You can see, this is our somehow the secret, how we produce the downpipe machine with very good performance pipe. This unit of the vertical roller will be inside of the pipe during forming. Then, across here, we can see one pipe is for round pipe. This is also water spout machine. Inside, you can check once we do the rectangular, that is such kind of the loading bar inside. Then for the round pipe, we have this sort of the device, which will be inside of the pipe during forming. And this machine will be much more longer than that one due to the pipe, different thickness and diameter. This is the secondary set, which is good for round pipe. One is rectangular and here is one round pipe. Then in the workshop, there is third one for the down pipe machine. Here, this one is almost 70% uh, down. Even we made the testing, a small test for pipe. And this machine is three in one. This is the unit for cutting, bending, necking system. This is the third unit located in our workshop. And uh, this machine 
somehow it's much more heavy duty than that one, the previous one. You can see once we do in the normal traditional downpipe machine, even the structure, everything is different. Even in this machine, once we put the once we load the wall panel stand onto the structure, we put this kind of the T rail, L rail, it will much more help for the straightness of the stands. This is how we united the roller, vertical roller, side roller, even on top of the. And this sort of the three-in-one machine, I already we already uploaded the several types of the machine into our YouTube channel. You may search a little, and you will find the video input feeding table. And side by side, we add this kind of the defense safety fans. This is the third downpipe machine in the workshop. The transmission way is also a chain with pillar of wall panel stands, but this one is a three-in-one machine. So the machine structure, everything will be better than normal one. Even a reference, once you want to decide that what kind of machine you're going to take. For more efficiency and for less waste of the material, of course, the three-in-one machine will be much more benefit. But of course, the machine is a little bit costly. You may follow us and we will give you more case once we choosing this sort of the downpipe machine. Thank you for staying with us. We have one unit machine, which is on the adjusting and in the final stage of the assemble and the adjusting. So this machine is made for three-in-one rectangular pipe, down pipe. This is the reference machine for you, as well as yours. So I am in the workshop to show you how we gonna build up the machines. This is the corrugated file. This is corrugated surface. Side roller, vertical roller, it will be all helped to form in the regular shapes. And in the forming, in the coming, like 18 stations, we have big gear to ensure the forming stage. So this is just, uh, and here is the, here is the decola unit. The feeding table, and we do have this. This unit is used for cutting and in front of that we will have the necking system and this is the necking die. It's not, uh, it's not assembled yet, but this, is, this unit is used for necking. Our workers is operate on the machine. 